Hey guys, how you doing? It's Henry, Mowers and Blowers. This is part uh, 8 of my uh, John Deere LA-105 lawn tractor. I got this for free. I've done quite a lot to it. Fixed the brakes. Um, got this engine. When I got this, it had no engine, so I got this engine from my buddy. Um, the charging system doesn't seem to be working. Um, I'll show you. I'm going to start up the tractor and uh, put a multimeter to that voltage uh, regulator. I'll start it up. Starts up great, runs great. I look up that voltage regulator. I got my uh, multimeter there. because it's connected to the battery, you know? So it's not charging. So it's not charging. It's, uh, I had charged the battery with my battery charger, so it's about, it was 12.5, but now it's running, it's down to 12.15. So, um, this black wire, which is the middle one, goes straight to the uh, battery okay it's connected straight to the battery so that was a 12.5 that you were seeing was the voltage of the battery and decreasing you know so I'm getting AC current to this uh, the left one here at 25 somewhat volts and then this one is getting 17.5 volts right and the middle one's not giving off any uh, DC current you know so uh, I ordered this uh, Kohler Courage voltage regulator. Got it on eBay used. He says it works. I uh, got this really cheap. This is six bucks. OEM too, original. I could have bought a aftermarket Chinese copy for like ten, but I'd rather have original for six, right? And uh, looks to be in good shape, you know, at least uh, visually. So. Um, I'm just going to loosen these two bolts there and put this on and reconnect it and see if I get anything out of that. So it was easy. Just uh, two bolts here and uh, removed it. There's the old one. And just put the new one in. Just like that. Now when I got this, uh, it didn't have this uh, ground strap. I put this on. I know it needs a ground strap. Even though this is metal, they have uh, other uh, command uh, stuff that's um, plastic, so they needed a ground strap to ground. But uh, just to be sure, I added my own ground strap. I know it should be black, but that's all I had. So I know that this is uh, ground. So just put the two um, bolts back on and um, tighten it up. Put this harness back on and we'll give that a try again. and. Uh, I'll uh, also put the prongs to the battery to see if it's charging, but it's the same thing if I just do it off of here because that's the battery charge. And I don't see any increases in voltage whatsoever, you know. 
so that's why it's not charging. Got to charge the battery, otherwise you'll run it, and with the lights on and all that stuff, you won't. Uh, you'll have a dead battery by the time you're done. So I buttoned it all up, and I'm gonna start it and try it. Exactly the same. routed the wire from the middle one to the one that goes into the harness and after I do that it charges coming directly from the voltage regulator cannot go straight to the battery. It has to be grounded. So when you put it to the harness, the harness is already grounded, a good ground, you know? So if this wire goes to where it's supposed to be, right, this leads directly to the uh, battery. So it's charging the battery that way. This, this wire here that I had connected on there is to the lights. This is the output to the lights. I gotta put this over here. That's my problem. So it was the wiring that was wrong. Well, I don't know. I mean, uh, I mean, it's charging, but it's not like 14 volts like I see other people's stuff doing 14 volts, you know? If any of you guys can make heads or tails out of why this isn't charging at 14 volts, let me know. This wire goes from the middle, right? So the two... Just so you're clear, two wires going into the stator. This one's giving off 25 volts AC. That side's giving off 25 volts AC, right? The middle one is giving off 12 volts, but it is slowly charging it. That wire goes all the way to this white wire that I have. See? This is going, this is the middle wire right there, and it's going into the wiring harness right to the red wire over here. This is the lights. The yellow wire with the white stripe is going into the wiring harness as well where it's supposed to be. But um, when I have it on the lights are working and even if I... Sh um, it, the lights are on all the time, okay? Even when I don't have it on the uh, light switch over there, it's still on. So it's, you know, I mean, it's charging the battery. I mean, it, but it's only like 12 volts, you know what I'm saying? And, and slowly rising. But I don't see any 1350, 1375, 14 volts, you know? So tell me what's up. Uh, it's supposed to have a new stator on there. That's what uh, Pete Lombardi told me. I suppose I could rip off the whole cover and see, you know? Uh, Robert Nighthawk told me that it could be a diode on the stator that's not working, but remember, I'm getting 25 volts AC off of that one, 25 volts AC off of this one, and this one is slowly charging 12 volts. Well, I mean, it, it seems to be only giving off that much, you know, so I don't know if it's working or not, but uh, I mean, I've been running and starting this thing all day, and I haven't, you know, battery hasn't died, you know, so it uh, seems to be kind of working. I mean, I'm okay, I'm okay with it as long as it maintains 12.5 throughout, you know. But I would like to see it charging 14 volts. Let me know if you guys uh, know what's up with it. I'm not much of an electrician. I don't like electricity. I don't like starting issues. But, uh, you know, it's a little confusing. But uh, put in my comment section if you guys know, okay? Appreciate it. Also, subscribe. I'm uh, 65 away from 1,000. I could use more subscribers. Help me out, will you? Thanks a lot. See you guys next time on Mowers and Blowers. 
I was never good at electrical. Maybe one of you guys can uh, help me figure out what exactly is wrong and why I'm not getting 14 volts. 12 point, 12 volts is good, but not...